Hey there reseller family, this is Tina and welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be back in Canva like last week, but this time we're going to be making very simple videos in Canva that you can use to upload to your listings, whether it be eBay or Etsy or Amazon. And I'm going to walk you through the simple process of making very simple beginner videos. So let's jump in and get started. Okay, so here we are in Canva and this is Canva's home page. Now I will have a link below this video in the description for you to try Canva the professional for free for 30 days if you'd like and there will be a link to my Facebook group which is a new beginning uh, slowly growing group but please if you want to join me there please do so and let's dive in to making our video. So when you're on the home page of Canva Right below are uh, different options of things that you can make and the first one just happens to be video so we're going to choose video it tells you below the dimensions it's making it in which is 1920 by 1080 pixels and if any platform needs that video to be a different size it's easy for us to change um, these pixels here. This is definitely cell phone friendly, which we generally want things to be. So I chose video, and since I'm recording, the computer's always a little slower. So we just got to give it a sec to upload. Okay. Now, this is our blank box where we can create video, and down below is how long each segment is going to be. So I took the liberty of let me move myself down here a bit of uploading some images off of a board game that happens to be on Amazon um, just to use for an example so I'm going to uh, choose this area uploads because this is where the images are located that I uploaded and if you want to upload your own images into Canva you want to click this button here so you can upload images videos and audios this happens to be images and we are going to create our video off simply off of images so this is the board game herd mentality it was popular at christmas so we can make a video just using images so i'm going to drag um, the edges here to make it bigger I don't know if you remember this from last week, but this blue box, once you put an image in, you can then put your cursor over the edges and drag. You can drag to resize the image to fill the screen. You can move it around. If you wanted to put it here and, and um, possibly put some text here. So let's say I want to put text. I'm going to, I don't know if my image is in the way, scroll down here and then I can choose the text option and then you can just choose this add a heading and you can say you know family fun game night um, and then we can drag these words to be smaller we can sometimes you got to click out of it to be able to drag it um, you can change the font if you didn't like that you can change it to all of these other fonts that are here in Canva. I think this looks good because it kind of matches the herd mentality. If I want to click over all of it, I can come up here and it will open up a color box. It usually will pull color C over here from this image and it pulls those colors. So you can select a complementary color or below you can choose your own color. So I'm going to choose the pink. And then you can have this be in your first slide. Okay, so now I'm going to show you the, we'll hit play, and you see it's only going to play this still image because that's all we have so far. Now I think five seconds is a bit long, so what we do is we put our cursor over and you will see it highlights and makes this gray box. You can drag it over and shorten the length of it. So we're going to shorten it, let's say, here to, you know, three something seconds. 
Now we want to add our next image. So I'm going to hit this plus sign here, so it's going to open up a new blank box. All right, so going back to uploads here, I'm going to choose the next image. And I'm going to do the same. I'm going to drag it out so it is bigger. Now, if we wanted to animate this image by making it pop or do something, we will click animate. And then you can make it do this little rise. You can make it pan out, fade. Um, then these are the, the ones, the things with the crown are the pro features, which you can get in the 30 day free, um, trial, the link I gave below. Otherwise, the um, free version, you can do this, but you just can't do all of the options. I kind of liked this, how it kind of slides. So I'm going to choose that. And we also don't want the video too long. So I'm going to drag it down. I think the other was 3.3 seconds. Okay. Now we're going to click the next plus size sign for our next frame of the video. We're going to go back to Uploads, and we're going to throw this in. And maybe we want to animate this a bit too, so we can hit Animate, and maybe we'll have it do something else. Okay, and we're going to drag it down to be the same. Well, close enough. All right, so now we're going to open up our next image. I'm going to go back to Uploads where images are, and we're going to add this pink cow. Okay. And maybe we don't want to animate this one. So we're still going to drag it down to keep our slides about the same length. And let's hit the plus sign. And we're going to add this in. So you guys get the idea of how you can just put still images in and create your own video um, with just pictures. I mean, you could do this with family photos and um, for parties, and you can use this feature for a lot of things. Right, and we're going to hit the plus sign, and we're now going to add our last image. And then maybe since this is the last slide, I want to add some text, and I'm going to say, Get your game, or we can say, let's do a discount. Um, grab for the month of April for 20% off using code heard and we're going to drag this in we're gonna and click the box up like this we can drag that in and then maybe we want to use the pink again. So we're going to click our color box. We're going to choose pink. And then if for those that did watch the video and you have a coupon box possibly on Etsy that uh, they can fill in, obviously for Amazon you can't do this. Um, but if it's, it's on a, um, I don't have Shopify, I, maybe you can do that for Shopify. Um, now let's drag this video down to the 3.3 seconds. All right, now we're going to um, play our video and let's see how it looks. So the 3.3 seconds might still be a little too long per clip, maybe not. So I like that little animation pop. I think that looks really fun. Maybe that's a good length. So what do you guys think? I hope you like this video today and how to make um, videos for your listings. I do want to um, come over here 
uh, to, all right, so here is in Etsy. If I were creating a listing in Etsy, here was where I'd add just the regular photos. And down below is where we can add a video. So you can download your video from Canva and upload it here to your Etsy listing. I now want to jump over to Amazon really quickly because I think this is interesting. There. Okay, so this is in Amazon and on a listing, Amazon recommends sometimes a video to be on listings that I haven't even created. And I will share the link to this page, but what you do is you click um, upload and manage videos and this is where you are going to upload a video for a listing and below they tell you um, what they recommend for a video so here they have that 1080p and I don't know if that's the PX for pixel or not that I'm not a hundred percent sure but I do know that when you download your videos in Canva you do download it to the MP4 so um, they tell you the rules here and you can upload your video. Now moving over to the next page here in Amazon, these are some listings that Amazon is saying that you can upload videos for. And um, let's just click on this one. And then you see it opens up this uh, area where you can upload a video on a listing that Amazon is actually recommending that you upload a video to. So let me know what you think and let me know if you try actually making a video and uploading it. Um, I'd really like to know. And there are some other fun features where you can put music over your videos too. And we can cover that in another video if you're interested. Thanks again for watching guys. Have a great day.